swisser full of marijuana. I got a swisser full of marijuana. I swear to God, these niggas down, boy. I swear to God, these niggas down, boy. I got a swisser full of marijuana. I got a swisser full of marijuana. I swear to God, these niggas down, boy. I swear to God, these niggas down, boy. Hey, uh, 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 we back, bitch. Yeah, episode no, forty-two. <laughs> episode forty-two. Uh, Smoking. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Happy Monday evening, or should I say Monday night? Y'all should have ate right now, right? Y'all should have ate right now. Yeah. Seven thirty. Yeah. If y'all if y'all eating after this, that's why you can't lose that weight. Uh, turn it down a little bit. Appreciate you. Uh. This episode, motherfucking 42, right? 42, yeah, 42 Doug. 42 Doug. Uh, I go by the name of Sport Run, the nigga on the other end of the table. He go by the name of Harvey Scales Jr. That's my dog. Yes, and we sir. are two thirds of motherfucking smoking gossip. Bree will be back. She done had the baby. baby. You hear me? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? If y'all just tuning in, share that shit. Uh, y'all got anything else to announce before you? Oh, y'all need to shop at Trim Benders. Uh, y'all need to shop at motherfucking, uh, y'all need to go to the G's, Clippers, get, get your hair cut. cut. There's so many motherfuckers up there that's doing hair and cutting hair. Uh, you got options. If you don't like one nigga, you definitely going to like the other. Uh, <laughs> who else? Um, uh, Me Casa Sue Cafe. I don't know if y'all missed it this weekend, but Soul Food Sunday there is crazy. They also got a crazy daily menu, too. So y'all go fuck with those three businesses as well as all your black businesses. I got to shout them brown. all out, even if they don't want to. Get sponsored by us. I gotta shout y'all musty ass out. Yeah, but we shouting out our sponsors. If you're looking for sponsorship yeah. on smoking gossip, please hit us up so you can get like G. You know what I'm saying? You can get like trans benders, you can get like me Casa What up, though, D Brown? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, congratulations, Bree, with your funky ass. Yeah. Uh 
was we sure about that? That one about the kill? Did we get to the bottom? No, we didn't. So we ain't oh, even we gonna touch okay, on that. Gonna I ain't get that. to read. You on know, it. I wasn't going crazy yeah, with that. I don't want to get into but, uh, that. I don't want you on here looking like Bree. You uh, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Giving I'm out false crazy. information. Crazy. You know what I'm saying? Man, fake news is a motherfucking dog. I ain't it? That's uh, what's trending now. Well, shit, we got to start from the top. No, I gotta start with YBA Kenny, bro. <laughs> I don't know if y'all know YBA Kenny, but those of you that are familiar with the Milwaukee rapper, I don't based need no rapper, hoes. Hoes need me. He's a Milwaukee based rapper, mean he lives here. His music might be outside this motherfucker, but he don't need the hoes. The hoes definitely need him. Yes, sir. It was brought to my attention today that YBA and Kenny has two. Not one, but two. Yes, sexy ladies <laughs> with the tattoo on them. Yes, they got the tattoo on them. Now, I ain't wanting to toot my horn, but there's a couple bitches walking around with sport riding on them, too. Mm. Good luck with that. Your face, though? <laughs> Not my nah, face. They got this nigga's face. <laughs> they went and got the face. They can say, bitch, I'm sport. You Cardi's know, and gold like, teeth all on yeah. their body. When they jump me, they definitely turn their head. I'm sport, too. <laughs> yeah, he's a tattoo artist. I don't know if he did the tats. I didn't get that far into the story. I just did know he I. He had to do. He's a tattoo artist. Yeah, maybe. Like, bitch, if it's if, if you love me, if you know it's if, let me. So I one know chick had it on her arm. The other chick had it on her leg. Type shit. So I know it's real. <laughs> Straight up. Hey, how many of y'all? How many of y'all getting that nigga's face tatted? Not that name. His face. Yeah, his whole yes, face. His whole face. To Not me. one, but two bitches. We can't even call them bitches. Mm -hmm. Yes, we can too. Yeah. Bitches. In my motherfucker. <laughs> that's why. That's why. I uh, guess the host is trying to prove they that love. they need him, huh? Yeah, because he, he don't them. need no love. He yeah, don't he need, need no the hoes. But I guess they trying to show him that they need him, I guess. Uh, shout out Pimpin'. Shout out Pimpin'. You hear me? Shout out Kenny. If you something tag on, him, you hear me? Something on Smoking Gossip, we ain't going to never hate on this Pimpin'. So. You can't Shit. knock the Pimpin'. I got a face. Crystal Smith says she got somebody face on her. It's nice, but it's a no for me. Oh, so she like it. Jessica J. She thought it looked nice. It's it was nice, very. One of them was cool. very detailed. The one on the leg was really good. Y'all ain't getting y'all nigga face tatted. Y'all shice. Hell no, nah, never. Crystal, you got your nigga face on you. Ah, nigga face. I could never. Whoa. <laughs> I'm getting my I'm getting my wife face on my chest. So I know it's real all summer. I don't know about tatting face. <laughs> Somebody else's face. Now your kids or something. I'm gonna have a change of heart every day, B. Don't they? Like <laughs> you wake up in that morning and you hate that bitch, then what? Now what? Yeah, I think she I think they went too far with the face. That's but crazy. he he wasn't bullshitting, you know. Stand your ground. He got the stand your ground law jumping off around of wherever he at right now. It's the stand your ground because they definitely his ground right now, and he's standing on them. You getting your girl tatted? Whole face on my chest. I'm lying. <laughs> Motherfucking get a name. He ain't my nigga no more, and I'm never taking it off. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> That nigga must be fine as a motherfucker. She like, who is that? Oh, that's that's Chico the bar. <laughs> <laughs> she like, bitch, that's Chris Brown. No, that, that's Corey. <laughs> he, hit, he hit her with the Hercules one time. Shit like this happened. This two bitches First with the all, same nigga face. If Never. I would if he would at least be First handsome. I got my kids too. Okay, I mean, but yeah, the kids actually, is... come. I mean, honestly, I can't take that from you. If you was in a relationship and your relationship lasted for a long period of time or whatever, I can't take that from you because that's a part of your timeline. It's cool for me. To me, it's part of getting. It's cool to get part of your timeline tattooed on you. It's the shit you went through in life. <laughs> a lot of people got meaningless tattoos. You know what I'm saying? So if the tattoo really meant something to you, then obviously. Kenny means the world to them bitches. She said, deceased relatives, yes. My nigga walking around here probably cheating on me and shit. No, pass. <laughs> Christopher said, I'm tatting her face on my face. <laughs> 
bitches can't even take that ill. Deceased crime. relatives, yes. My nigga walking around here probably cheating and shit. I'm a pass. That's hilarious. That's funny. Bitches can't even take that L in private. Mm. Can't. Since we was kids, we got history. I mean, yeah, that's part of your timeline. He ain't even cute. That's what they laughing at. <laughs> Them hoes think Kenny cute. Hoes got a motherfucking Rottweiler on there with some yays on their motherfucking <laughs> No, I'm just bullshitting. I big fuck guy. with Kenny. Kenny, that no, nigga. No, that's my guy. I he fuck with my Kenny. Guy, but he ain't, he ain't too big for a joke now. Shit, we all. Yeah, we, uh, we know we crack him. Mm-hmm. Plenty teeth and Cardi's all That's cool all. for a That's name, but a face is next level. I couldn't. I mean, I, who got their face at it? Listen, I, we, I wish we could just show y'all a picture of it. I wish we could show y'all a picture of it. Like uh, That's that bang bang yeah. shit. Uh, I wish we could show y'all a picture of that shit, bro. We, we ain't even I couldn't, vision. I mean, that's what Deasia said. She couldn't do it. Kenny, Kenny looked like, look a, like horse, a horse, but that's, that's my, my dude. dude. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody said yeah. Kenny. Here they come. Ah, you shit. know how our audience All is. All my tattoos have meaning, but it happens more often than not. Names, faces, and cases. Mm. All my All life, he looked like, like a rock wilder. That's funny as a bitch. Hey, they uh, all funny as a fuck. <laughs> I never had a nigga named tatted, tattooed on me. And I never will. Don't you never, ain't never been in love. That's what I'm going to say. Don't never say never. Somebody going to hit you with that squawk one time. Right. You going to fix up some tacos and go right to the tattoo parlor. Forget your face tattoo. <laughs> prolific on your shit. Yeah. No, the other pimping Ken. The rapping one. Yeah, the rapping. The rapping Kenny. Why the end? I don't need no hoes. Hoes, hoes need, need me. me. Yeah. This dance. Uh. 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 So when his bitches do the dance, they flash the tattoo. Yeah. Like, huh. Huh. He ain't wrong. Nah, he a player. Man, listen, I always, I always was taught you find a fool bust his head. <laughs> he a player. Find a fool bust his head. That was your that was your come up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, some Dawson, people. That's, a, that's yeah. some young people shit. They ain't no young people shit. Ain't no young people shit. I know some old motherfuckers getting people tatted on. What's up, man? Y'all gotta stop putting Holland shit Park, on the young people all the time too. Shout out Holly Park. What it do, Nate? Baby, you heard me. This is my second time watching, and this shit be lit. Thanks, Chris. Appreciate that. You heard me. Bro? <coughs> what? We got the motherfuckers got to stop putting shit on young people all the time. Yeah, that's why the young niggas be like, your old, old niggas, niggas be hating. hating. Y'all got to stop, stop putting that. That's some young nigga shit. Yeah. All the young nigga. I know plenty old, old fools. Niggas. Me too. Plenty of them. I know plenty old fools. And I don't respect them just like I don't respect them young niggas that be doing that's foolish fool. shit. Yeah, exactly. 100. He a player, no bullshit, dog. That nigga ugly. <laughs> he had, de her head definitely bust. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Tapping in. What it do, Hoodlum? What's the word? Dino. Definitely standing on him. So now that y'all know that YBN and Kenny ain't playing, you hear me? All you niggas talk that P mm, shit. Y'all running around here driving peace. your baby mama car thinking y'all doing something. You still got to fill that bitch up Major before said, you drop it off. Major said young <laughs> fools become old fools. Facts. Yeah. Hard to teach an old dog yeah. new tricks. I mean, yeah, we ain't going to put no gender on it. Just know that there's some fools and we can't put an age limit on it because yeah. that shit. Ooh, what? I know plenty of Ignorance old is dumb. bliss. Some shit. niggas shouldn't call them ugly and they ugly too. I'm sick of you. Right, right, right. Old fools wants young fools. Facts. I would have turned this shit into young niggas versus. I done turned That's this shit into uh, young niggas versus old niggas. We about to switch sides on y'all motherfucking ass. Uh, we got to talk about Lucci now. Lucci yeah, well, said he gone, man. Yeah, Lucy, Lucy <laughs> said Milwaukee y'all tripping. I'm out of here. <laughs> Lucci said shots fired. Shots fired. Man, doubt Donna. I'm gone. <laughs> you hear me, though? I'm gone. What the fuck was y'all doing in Kiss, man? 
Huh? Shit. What the fuck was y'all on up in there, man? What the fuck was y'all doing? Ladies was popping pussy. And the niggas was standing around talking about what's popping in the streets. And you wanted to shoot each other and shit. That's what they were on. I don't know. Was it a firecracker? Was it a gunshot? Do we know? I know for sure. Two things for certain. I don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck which one it was. You hear anything out of the ordinary, you're going to break Oh, you, fast. yeah, oh, yeah. In a dark nightclub with plenty gangsters you in that drunk. motherfucker? What the fuck else you is you drunk, supposed to do? You you high? Man, shit, I'm trying to get in between some big bitches. I'm going to keep it real. I'm running right in your crowd. <laughs> they popped a firecracker. That's what Crystal said. Lucci said, uh uh. I'm out of here on you, nigga. Free promo, I guess. He thought Young Thug was in there. <laughs> That's funny as a bitch. Right. They were sucking dick and popping firecrackers. No, the sucking dick happened at the another club. The sucking dick we happened at We're going to get to that. We're going to talk about that. That happened downtown at the white people joint. Yeah. Who the fuck goes to the club and pops <laughs> black, cl- black cats and shit? Shit, uh, I know a nigga personally. I was in the club with a nigga. I'd be around, and he was getting oral next to us, and we didn't even know it. We looking around like everybody else. Like, what the fuck? Security like, no, man, not right here. He took her in the bathroom and finished it off. <laughs> so if it ain't no, if it wasn't no shell cases found, if it was only one shot fired. She said, I live in Atlanta, and Lucci ain't with that shit. I th- I just think it's stupid to pay to go to a event and fuck it up. Big facts. Big facts. Like, this is what I'm saying. Like, they didn't even get, well, they got some of it. Yeah, but they didn't get to Lucci. But they didn't get Lucci. Mm. I know a lot of people wanted to see, you know, uh, Chop and Looney perform, mm. but they really wanted to see Lucci. And they, I don't know if you can say Well, locally, it was a nice lineup because you had 54. You had... Fifth, five, you know, Rizzy on you had 54 baby, you had Rizzy, you had Looney, you had Chop, you had Chicken, you had Jig. Mm. So it was a nice opening. The opening acts was strong, you know what I'm saying? So, where are when you go to need them? My niece worked there, two people with, really with got Lucha. shot. She said, My niece worked there, two people really got shot. Mm. She is she a bartender. bartender. I mean, that, that's what I heard, but you know. I don't know. We fucking up promotion for Milwaukee artists. Yeah, that wasn't Not a good really. look. That wasn't a good look. She said, Clooney, Looney, good, Looney. Good look. 40 worth of drinks to get you topped in the Clizza, man. <laughs> uh, that's crazy. Uh, you think that fucked up rappers' image? I mean, you think that fucked it up for the local niggas or no? No. You don't think Hell that was a bad no. look? Honestly, right. man, listen. That's what's supposed to happen what, what, at, at they at they shows. What what does the media want? They want ignorant shit. Ignorant shit cracks. Nigga, listen. That's what I'm at. That's why I'm asking the hypothetical. He like coming that, back. Like. Hey, bring it back. Hey, Luke, you want to come back? Yeah. Oh yeah, they wasn't shit. shooting at him. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, no, I'm just saying he coming back. Like shit. Last, you know how yeah. it go. They wasn't and they wasn't shooting at him. It ain't like he <laughs> got into it with some niggas here. Man, and listen, and, they said a motherfucker. Well, she said the motherfucker got popped. Listen, all publicity ain't good publicity when you're doing the club. Uh, see, that, that's the point that I was because about to make. Because nine times out of ten, it didn't happen at a white-owned club. It I, happened at a black-owned club. This black-owned club probably taking care of so many such and such. And I hate going into history on And they shit. really don't want to lose another black club. We kind of mm. show. But we Puff, got bars. We got no black clubs like that. But you Puffy know? back in the day, right? Because you got to think about, bro, they shot up the we'll Miramar. This is just this summer, my nigga. They shot up the Miramar. They shot up the Kiss Miramar. when the Detroit niggas was there. And then they just had another shooting now. So I'm saying, like, when you look at the shit in a large, large scale it up for their license, man. of the shit, like, you you want to be endangering shit. Rap fans have to be putting their lives on the line to be fans of rap music. Like, that's some bullshit right there when you really think about it. Like, I should be able to enjoy this gangster rap shit and be in a safe environment. That's what I'm coming to these places for, where they got security and Big they got facts. this type of shit there, right? Big facts. I'm not going to fam trap house while he in there doing his thing and trying to mingle with them niggas. I'm at a show enjoying fam. If he a street nigga or whatever he is, you get what I'm saying? You should be safe. That's my whole thing. Safety first with that type of shit. <laughs> hey. 
Somebody said, was it a firecracker or a gunshot? She said it was a bomb. <laughs> but it may be that bitch. But the crazy part is, is that if it was a gunshot or it was a firecracker, they did great damage control. You know what I'm saying? Oh, they did PR. That's what they supposed to do. Them some businessmen. Whoever handling that situation, they know what the fuck they doing. Because the average average cat would have I'd have been like, cooked. man, who got shot? Oh, bitch, you. Uh, I'm driving her. I drive her. <laughs> what you need? Look. Because even before, that type of shit even before, even before the, for this. <laughs> even before the puffy <laughs> real. situation with Shine in the club where they was shooting and shit yeah. that night with J Lo, he had a situation back in the day. He got sued like a motherfucker. Some motherfuckers died at a party he had, and he like over capacity the building or something, and they held him liable for that shit. They do. You see build. what I'm saying? So they you do. can't, you can't do that kind of shit. You know what I mean? She said, "Why me and Kenny did it." <laughs> That's how rumors get started. Free money for Lucci. Yeah, damage control is a motherfucker. Scales, the threat came from the crowd, not the artist, though, family. No, what I'm I'm not saying it came from the artist. I'm saying the the threat came from the crowd exactly. So the the venue has has to be safety first. That's my point. Nobody should get in there with a gun. That's a lot of rollers and Molly. You know on the what I'm street, saying? That's bro. my that's what my point was. I don't know if I got it all the way out because I'm a little high right now, but that's what I was trying yeah. to get to. There's huh? a lot of rollers and Molly on the streets right now. I'm, so you got to expect some shit to pop yeah, off there now and then right now. Make sure they high. don't make sure they don't get that niggas shit in high, there. Bro. That's all I'm saying. Niggas high, bro. You were safe at Summerfest yesterday, wasn't you? Yeah. Yeah, because you're not getting that shit in Summerfest. That's my point. You know what I'm saying? Protect these, protect the fan, bro. At the end of the day, you even if the fan putting itself in harm's way, you got to protect them. They in your establishment. That's how you're held liable. That's why the owners of Kiss or whoever is handling their PR is saying it was a firecracker and not a shot because that's a liability. You know what I'm saying? I just watched the Shine documentary probably about a week ago about that shit in him, with him and Puffy, and they were interviewing the people who got shot and shit. They won big-ass lawsuits for getting shot and that shit, bro. Because Puffy and them was held liable for that. Even right. though he beat the criminal case, he got sued civilly still. He still had to pay them people. You see what I'm saying? So, mm. I'm gotta, just saying, though, like, if I'm in the club and I hear a loud pop, whether it's a firecracker or a gunshot, your heart start beating hell fast. Hell yeah. Regardless, That's you go to race. Afro Fest effect. Fuck? Remember Afro Fest back in the day? Yeah. Dream teams back in the day? He got a gun. What? Everybody gone. Oh no, he got a gun. You ain't seen it. Ain't flashing, nigga. Yeah, Just that's on security. Screen, All my oh, security man. be fired. Any, anytime. Shit, what the fuck are you doing with a firecracker in the club? And then, like I tell a motherfucker all the time, bro, we lost a childhood friend to that. Yeah, but who, who? We you did. know what I'm saying? Pat but, died behind who, some shit like who that. Who wants security letting a nigga security in with a letting pistol. a nigga in the club? Yeah, yeah. Everybody, fine. security got to go first. Security got to go first. I don't know if security following this page or they watching the show, but if you work for me, you'd be fired, fucker. <laughs> fired. You like I ain't paying you yeah. shit, nigga. You had one thing to do. You had one thing to do. Pat these niggas down. Make and sure check nobody get in here with that shit, boss. Instead, you sweat niggas about blunts and shit. You know what I'm saying? You ain't sweating pistols. You sweating me about bringing blunts. And in that is right. Just like the bullshit happened in Corsair. Niggas be dick riding. Hold on. Who trying to be cool and do your job? Your life is in jeopardy too, dummies. Facts. Three people said they seen four other motherfuckers up strapped after the shots. Whole club damn near was strapped. Damn. That's what I'm saying. Our uh, cult. But what I'm saying is, is our culture is that right now. So you got to step up the precautions. Summerfest got metal detectors and shit because they bringing hip hop acts to their grounds and they know hip hop act fans come strapped. You know what I'm saying? We strapped, fam. That's our, that's the environment. That's how we living right now. If you right. a straight laced dude or a street dude, you got a pistol. Big and it can seal in carry city or state. If you in one of them, you strapped. Yeah. And if you like rap music, you going to the show. You know what I mean? Freezer. With the same shit. Freezer. Yeah, man. Wow, son. 
It should gotta be safety. Man, first. safety first. Motherfuckers gonna lose their job because tonight. It, at the end of the day, you want motherfuckers they need to be metal safe. detectors. And we want the artists to, to get their money. They got these security letters. You know what I'm saying? You shooting up heat. the show and you fucking with a nigga money. Real. Craig always thought his security was high tech. You putting the artist in jeopardy. The artist in there with an armed guard. What if he in there with an armed guard? Because he got a licensed guard with him. He done paid them G's to have his what license. What type of grown ass guard. nigga bring a firecracker in the club? That's what I was thinking. Who want to set off a firecracker during a concert? Who wants to get a motherfucker riled up like that? You know what I'm saying? You know the outcome. What the fuck? Who do that? Uh, they ain't going to listen to yeah, one of the people get killed. Here. He had right. one in his pocket still. Like, oh, Most shit, let me like this It took them way too fan. long to make it to that incident. <laughs> I don't know if y'all seen the videos that they posted in the uh, group, but shit, that shit broke out wild in that Man, motherfucker. what? It they set said, off a melee. They said they tore that motherfucker up like Players Club. Yeah. Hell yeah. I seen all the barricades was knocked down and everything. everything. Then they was fighting all in the parking lot and shit. You know what I'm saying? To the outside, yeah. Type shit. Then I seen the video of the police walking through the club with the big sticks out. Like, and they didn't treat they that shit like, like it was a firecracker like went off in that motherfucker the, the way same. they came through that bitch. Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, man, listen, you got to be, you got to be aware. Like, I, I made a stat the other day. I don't know how many of y'all my friends on Facebook, but you got to be aware of what the fuck going on around you. Just because you with some motherfuckers don't mean everybody looking out. Motherfuckers feel like because they deep that they ain't got to watch out. Man, you got to pay attention yeah. to what the fuck going on. Motherfuckers sleep slow and stupid out here. You can lose your life being in the wrong place at the wrong time because you're not aware. If you see tension, <laughs> you know, damn, they get the fuck out the way. You know what I'm saying? So I don't, if, if it happened I like that. But you know what? A lot of people going. Uh, the rumors is going to still it's, spread it's anyway funny that through you the streets because we don't I, got no facts yet. I hate to even bring this up because it was a nice event, but at the day party, right? You listening? Yeah. We was chilling. Lau here, he can attest to this. And then all of a sudden, like that, bro, it just went down. Like, God and I be it. on point. I don't drink or none of that shit. I be paying. I be on point. All, I'm talking about in the blink of an eye, my nigga. It went down. Yeah, right before the right before the Lucci shit. Was that the DJ right? Yeah, that was the day party right before the Lucci shit. You know what I'm saying? I am gonna read you, Michelle. God damn. What well, Michelle what said. said. They Michelle said G Baby kept and that's singing. Why they don't they like people from the like, Steel Cuz moment. That. Shout out G Baby, man. They went from the Steel Cuz moment from him. That yeah. shot went off. He finished his note. Y'all got him yeah. fucked up. Oh, that's funny as a bitch. Well, nigga, y'all got him fucked up. <laughs> my mama. That's funny. Now, speaking of that good top on the dance floor. <laughs> see, I know y'all think that that happened at the same club. But they was just spreading the rumor. And the rumor mixed in with the chaos and melee that happened at the other club. See this? No, nah, this happened in the upscale yeah, club, this right? on Milwaukee Street. With Nigga, the whites. Yeah, the whites. They was in uh, Young 720, man. You know, they was in 720. And I don't know if y'all ever been in 720, but 720 is wild. Wow, like, yeah, 720 is a wild joint. I have been, in, I have been in 720, and I done had people walk up to me and say, bro, you knew I got some powder. Or I done had people say, you know I got that powder on man. that. Or if you want to, if you want to, uh, you know, you try to catch me and call me. <laughs> You know, the plug is Swear always cutting That's into you. You don't yep. know if they're the police or the plug for real. Now, 720, the white bitches, they are not looking around. They are not checking the guys out. They are dancing. Yeah, they partying. I'm talking about dead dancing. You ever seen a white bitch dance when she drunk? She danced like this. They right. bump into everything. Just jumping, right? That was the no, T.I. on Friday. And then she just shake her hair like she, you know. Like it was a million her, of them at the T.I. on Friday. That's how she called it being sexy. That's why she being sexy, by shaking her hair while she just bouncing around like this, right? So. <laughs> so, so I guess 
Some guy was dancing, you know, giving her the groove, you know, that she was craving because she's there yeah. to cuss him up. Yeah. Somehow he ended up with his dick in, his, in, in her, her mouth. mouth. Yeah, she went down and bust one of them white girl moves. I plopped his piece in her mouth. You know what I'm saying? So if y'all looking for a good time, y'all need to stop the hood clubs. Put on some slacks and some nice motherfucking casual shoes. Go on down to 720. No, you might get your yeah, shit. Yeah, they ain't got no dress code down there no more. What? That's 720. They ain't got no dress Hell code? Hell no. Oh, mm -hmm. nigga got sucked to some dookies. That was a nigga got sucked. <laughs> I couldn't tell. Was that a nigga? That, that was, was a, a nigga. nigga? Yeah. Oh, I thought that was a white dude. No, that was a nigga got oh. sucked by a white girl. Oh. She could have been white or Hispanic. You know how they rocking down there. Yeah, you know they was the high groove. as fuck. They always high as fuck. I swear, they, on my life, they dance like the weekend at Bernie's. Yep. Except they just yep. moved their hair. Yep. And that, <laughs> I'm telling you, spoiled. That's how the Ti was, cause you know <laughs> you went to the Lil Wayne, so people had seats. Man, it was at the Ti. Chicks. Wasn't no seats, bro. bro. It was some white chicks right in front of me, bro. Four of them, and they was dead, dead. drunk doing that dance. I'm telling you, they was pissing the black girls that was around me off, nigga. They was ready to send it up right there. I'm like, man, they drunk, man. Leave them white girls alone, man. They flashing titties. This Summerfest. I'm like, I feel like I was in California for a minute or something. Them white girls was going crazy for T.I. <laughs> the like, dress code man. is slack and no draws. <laughs> <laughs> she said no first lies. Yeah, no go to 720. You want to get your dick sucked? Go to 720. They, they, need to, the, they need to put us on the pro, uh, pro roll. Oh, they giving pro. They giving Hit top down there. They need to, hey, that's my kind of club now. They need to sponsor. And I might need to go on and gossip. try to give me a night down there. That's my type up. of shit. Go to 720. I think he was trying to fucking Fred Allen shit, bro. They was, they was trying to get like like Fella. Ooh, and I don't think yeah. Fella fucked nothing in the club yet. Hey, the crazy thing is, is that... That's where the Bucks be at. That's where all oh, the yeah. famous people the brewers, be at. Like, everybody, that's where yeah. the rich, rich motherfuckers rich, rich, be rich. at. When you go, when you pull up downtown and Lamborghinis and shit out, that's where they be at in yep. 720. Tasha Monasha know what we talking about. She be White girls going wild. Trying to get your dick sucked. Go to 720, dog. Yeah, old Milwaukee Street. Don't, don't they still, is, is, is Dick still? Right uh, next door. Still, do Dick still got a white crowd too on one of them nights? No, they black. Oh, they done ran them off. Blush are all, all black. But see, 720, see the thing about 720 you get your dick sucking 720. It's seven, I, and blush. 720. Matter of fact, you still can get your dick sucking blush because they got different floors. floors yeah. And if it ain't cracking, but you can seven, always dip 720 off is them very floors. dark. That was the point I was about to make about 720. It's also not yeah, as lit. Yeah, nerd it's nerd other nerd. Lit, like as bright as other nightclubs. <laughs> it's very dark in 720. No, I said white bitch had that nerd to ask me if I was tip at Lucid the other night. <laughs> Tell Marty, that's funny as hell. Oh, on what? You, you kind of favorite tip, cuz? They both turn. Take Junior, take Junior, take Buddy with you. Be love sloppy. He's love sloppy. Let's get Westbrook to the buck. I'm with that. Dixie's is look, weak. She said it's dark as fuck in there. I heard about levels. Yeah. It's dark as yeah, fuck in there. They said we Campaign just got that motherfucker cracking for the next two weeks. Bro came straight on here on yeah, some uh, sports agent shit. See, that's what I was about to say about the crowd <laughs> at 720, though, Spool. It's, 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 got it's like the Rainbow the Coalition, bro. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. The crowd at 720 is all the people of every race with money. Big like, so the rich black niggas, they at 720. Yeah. Street and corporate. Street too. Them Both. There they there. Up. Then you got the A Arabic motherfucking crowd. They got four, five sections they with really bottles don't and want shit. Black girls then it's the rich Spanish motherfuckers. Then it's the rich white boys. Like, that club is very, like, high school almost when you go in that motherfucker. Like, it's like a 220 high school. Like, brown deer. Like, you got the black table. You got the white people table. You get what I'm saying? That's how they club is set up almost. But Tasha, they cater to the rich niggas. Yeah. Like, they really don't want none of us our regular ass in there. You know what I'm saying? They be letting black went, girls in 720 because them rich no, white boys saying, like black girls. It's a certain type. Type, yeah, a certain type of black girl. Yeah. yeah. 
Some of y'all ain't gonna make the cut. I'm just letting you know. Hey, Jama, yeah, man, keep we alive like you see on the movies. I swear to God. See, see, Jama, that's my that's my that's my Somalian homeboy. You see what he said? We used to fuck 720 up. Yeah. See what I'm saying? Very diverse joint, <laughs> and it's gotten more diverse because it's got a, one of the four owners. Because it's got a couple of owners now, or people that run are in operations. I don't want to call them all owners, but Jonah Tucker. Shout out my dog Jonah. He's watching the show sometimes. Is not like he that. part of the ownership. <laughs> And he black. You see what I'm saying? So it's gotten a little more diverse. I mean, it's gotten more diverse. I'm saying they let more black people in there. They're yeah. letting more black people in there right now than they ever were. That's yeah, my yeah, point. Yeah, they are. You ain't got to be super exclusive to get in there no more. You used to have to, like, I used to get in there because I'd be with a Bucks player or somebody like that. You know what I mean? Now you ain't got to be that. You can get in that motherfucker now. Yeah, that's what we're here for, bro. We're here to put you up on something new. Uh, speaking of something new, Scales. What's happening? My brother. What up, baby? To my niggas in the back. My brothers. How y'all feel about this cucumber, cucumber challenge. challenge? How many of the ladies in the comments is doing the cucumber challenge? Q. Folks in them want to know. Challenge. And before y'all go to the jokes and shit, because I seen a bunch of ladies that, how many these niggas they working with the cucumber? Bitch, ain't nobody asked you what a nigga was working with. I asked you, how did you feel? About the cucumber challenge. You, if you know anything about the cucumber challenge, uh, it started about a good three weeks ago. Yeah, a good three weeks ago, Rajan and Lucci broke up Cup behind the cucumber. It, yeah, she don't never want to fix it. She feel like he disrespected her in the ultimate way by putting the heart faces under Boosie's post of the cucumber challenge. So I want to know how y'all feel about the cucumber challenge. <laughs> I done won like 27 times, facts. Damn. Damn. That's not ladylike. Never. Ooh, they about to smack her. They, her inbox is about to be smacky smack. They don't know. That's sick. Somebody mm. said ass loud. Folks them want to know. Don't you, Viv? Folks them want to know. I man. spoke for folks them before folks they even checked in. Know. I told you folks them want to know. They done checked in. Like, Viv, if y'all want to see my know. challenge, go on my oh. YouTube channel. What? what? Toss them on now. So you capping. I think she front. I think she big cap. I think she put cap. the link in the comments. Then put your link in the comments because mm -hmm. you big cap, big old graduation cap, and gown. You God crapping damn gown. Damn these motherfucking Jolly Rancher gummies Fire. are the fucking truth, my nigga. Never. I'm sorry. I mean, to each his own. We mm. not we not judging nobody. You know what I'm saying. I, niggas do all type of Look, shit. Don you know? Bravo said, "Drop the link. Drop the link, lady. Like, stop it. I never once said twenty seven people. So, anyways, <laughs> where that come from? I swear I did it yesterday. Look, they saying post the link. Okay, post Tasha, that link. We Tasha. want that link. The folks, you see folks now checking in. No copy and post that fucking. They want link. that niggas link. Niggas want to see that. Cause oh my fiel, I and tried that's to call so you funny. Cause the ladies on here like man, fuck that shit. Do all the niggas like oh, man, we're the link, in, bro. <laughs> we talking about the cucumber challenge, baby. We want to know who for it and who ain't. Obviously, we got two people. <laughs> we got two people. That's with it. That's with it. I just said all the, the fellas is with it. It was little though, so it's relatable. They, Ain't that a bitch? They gonna do the eggplant next. If dick actually tasted like a pickle cucumber, I would try. I've seen it. some bitches doing the eggplant before. Or my mama, bro. Hey, the one nigga, Club Godzilla. Out of, out of, think he out of Texas or something. He's she said, "Just club. suck some real dick." What's on the challenge? stage? Like stuffing that shit in bitches' mouths. Like what? She said, "Just suck some real dick." What's the challenge? Mm. Her invite's about to crack. Mm. They gonna do a them women seeking attention uh, the wrong okay. way. She said they gonna do a uh, eggplant. Eggplant egg next. If they put an eggplant, they mouth, God damn. Big uh. mouth bias. Big cap. Got y'all. <laughs> Fuck them. Uh, look, he went and checked. <laughs> Fuck them. Get them motherfuckers. Black forest joint sport. The only thing I'm sucking in the popsicle and lollipop. Captain is lying, uh, Daniel. You the lying. Woman, That's the women what seeking means. attention the wrong way. I suck dick them. in the I club challenge. I like sport. that. Hashtag that. Hashtag suck dick what in the club that? challenge. Let's suck. start that, ladies. Ooh. Fuck that sport. 
every day. Wee. Suck dick in the club challenge. That's the new challenge. Fuck the Megatron challenge Nicki Minaj got going on right now. Fuck that cucumber. Suck something in the club <coughs> for the folks challenge. Challenge? Oh, that's about to go crazy out here in these streets. That's cracking. I what they going to do, put I you think out? I, I think, no, I was about to say something. All they, they can do is put you out. Yeah, hey, that's it. They can't do nothing. You if, ain't we ain't got no, if we ain't got no slapper, baby mama's on here, we good. We definitely ain't going to have nobody challenge. But if we got some slapper, baby mama's on here. He said the chick from Love and Hip Hop, Akbar, she went Sweaty crazy. Balls. She was moaning and all kinds I of I seen one girl with an eggplant in the challenge. God damn. Two for three dollars. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm super old school. For the folks on oh, my mama. That's funny as a bitch. Y'all crazy. <laughs> <laughs> you know we crazy, y'all, if we got this nigga saying we crazy. Yeah, damn. Sweaty balls, huh? The sweaty right. balls challenge? No, what? So you want us to go hoop and then come uh, shake them bitches the in your face? face. <laughs> give top to some sweaty balls? Y'all crazy. Bitches going to end up with throat trauma. <laughs> Most of the women are born after the 80s, have no mind of their own. They do anything for the clout. Mm. Okay, Wanda. Speaking a little knowledge of you young bitches. No, I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. Though. Hey, you know, I'm, you know I'm playing, y'all. She got a deep one. Man, what? Facts. Deep one. Sport, if two, they do sucking dick in the club <laughs> challenge. Nigga, I'm going out every night. Get this old boy dusted right off. Turn back to platinum. We got to get platinum some motherfucker. Look, uh, somebody said nuts with the extra salt. <laughs> I would definitely tap out. <laughs> no, bottle top challenge. What the fuck is that, man? I seen, oh, never. That bottle top challenge is trash. That kick, yeah, shit. that kick shit. I seen the eggplant challenge. Had me like, show me. That's a little something. I love sweat all over me. See, but you white, Michelle. You, you, you be on that type of shit. Like, you probably be like, man. Hit me in my motherfucking ear with that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> That's what the white bitches like. They like weird shit. Like that. You know Go watch the video. LOL. I know. Don't play it at all. Okay. Uh, next topic. Hey, did you? Did we talk about the boosters or did I just post the video? I think we posted the video. Them motherfuckers hit, my nigga. Why they don't never hit me for the licks, bro? Why they don't never call me and be like, bro, you want to run? We about to go get this money. So the dudes that ran in, what's the name of the other store they was in? North Face. And did the snatch and grab with the mob or whatever. They also, hey, hit, up, they also hit up True Religion in Pleasant Prairie, too. And did the, and did the same thing. So I thought True Religion was out of business. Man, Somebody true bought religion. True Religion or something? True Religion out here still selling jeans. Fuck you mean? Man, I could have swore I seen a report where they had went out of business or some shit. Niggas like ain't that. looking for no triple stitching for the 270. No more. No more, exactly. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with them, but niggas, ain't, I mean, niggas straight with the truths they got. Like, if you got a pair of truths, go rock them motherfuckers. But going to get the new ones, I think that's out of the question. Man. You know what I mean? Nigga, ain't nobody but throw their shit away because a motherfucking tide passed. But at the end of the day, I don't think. I don't know. Any don't of y'all going it. to get a new true fit anyway? I'm confused. Uh, I am I'm confused. Because I, I didn't even know true was still cracking. Uh, yeah, this is beyond me. Camera footage, bro. Straight up. Snatch and grab, though. Man, that snatch and grab was epic. I, do, I doubt they got away with 30,000. I've seen that footage. 30,000. Mika says she asked if people still wear them. They selling true at City Trends. See? Man, it's they over. exaggerated that amount. Ain't no way. Yeah, North Face is old expensive. Niggas. North <laughs> Face don't lose Dark its value. Said, Dark said old niggas wearing true. True, true religion was a trend. So my thing yeah. is, is niggas don't even wear their jeans like that anymore. So that's how I know niggas ain't buying true no more. <coughs> KD. Hell no. 
to the no, no. Yeah, and this is no. a guy who going shopping all the time. His brother is loud pack. What? So they already let you. He said it was a long time ago. He bought some trues. You gonna throw your old shits though and get out here? You ain't for to go wear up to the club, but you'll throw them on, right? No. I want you ain't no, even wearing no He don't more. like the way they cut no more. He don't oh, even okay. wear Okay, niggas ain't wearing like trues no more. Them shit's done, y'all. Niggas, Throw niggas ain't even wearing that cut no more. I'm we, sure it's a few niggas, but I'm saying majority. You know what I they mean? Said, They're not wearing that cut anymore. Oh, a lot of bitches going to be pissed. They done went and spent all their money on them uh, Miss Me's and them Rocks and them motherfucking trues. Just so their booty can look fat. Flat booty ass. <laughs> Dawson said in Appleton, the trues, the trues booming. And Appleton, <laughs> dog said niggas wear joggers. That's it, pretty much. That's how another way you know niggas ain't wearing true like that. Yeah, they niggas do. Niggas be though. having on jogging pants. Dog said niggas rocking Not loud just life. joggers. Niggas wearing every. Yep, niggas wearing loud life on my mama. Yeah, that's true. Them gonna be the granddaddy shit. Look, look, look. Uh, yeah, cause we wear we wear jogging pants in winter time. I wear all jogger suits Man. in the winter time. You know me, I'll put one on Trues ain't Every tight day. enough no more. Oh, they not. Trues that got baggy as a bitch like your balls. You instantly bow leg when you buy some Trues. <laughs> <laughs> you instantly bow leg. <laughs> <laughs> Dog, that's funny as a hey. bitch. Oh, what? Look, Rita said Appleton. Right, who the fuck is Appleton? Dog said Niggas Trues making booming fashion statements at Appleton. I thought that motherfucker was little as a bitch. Dog niggas jumped out here with the whole true fit. Like. One nigga that's on here from Appleton, please check in, because we need to know who the fuck is Appleton. Rocking true. Rocking the true fit. Straight up. Yeah, Lump be up there. I seen Lump in the club last he night. He don't live there. Shout out Lump G. Lump came be all to the up strip there. club. Shut up. Because I'm wearing my shit. No true, though. You wearing what? Your Miss Me's? And we ribbing. <laughs> <laughs> I said, these motherfuckers smell like mothballs. <laughs> <laughs> she pulled them bitches out of a box. <laughs> no, said she jumped Appleton out. and Oshkosh. Hot tub time machine and put them motherfuckers on. I still wear Miss Me's and everything. I wear whatever jeans comfortable and I don't care how expensive Dawson they are. call me bow-legged You ain't in. wrong. I mean, like I said, to each his own. To each his own. Baby fat, bitch. But on everything, call me bow legged Lou. That's why he's a bitch, dog. Appleton. TC crazy, dog. T Water, you funny as fuck. What he say? Call me, call me, oh, yeah, call me bow legged Lou. Then I yeah. said I'm rocking all my shit. My fucking this. Leo, thing. what's happening, Leo? Leo on there? Yeah, oh, I see. Uh, they still wearing Muskeen and Appleton. Appleton. That's funny as a bitch. <laughs> Where who from? We from? We why from, do we in Milwaukee? We from Milwaukee. That's why I stick to polo. That'll never get old. Yeah, you see me rocking the horse. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that'll never go out of style. Levi's never go out of style. Yeah, you put you on some Levi's. Levi's make skinny jeans. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Niggas is wearing Levi's with you the holes in the knees right and one. shit. You, you know what I'm saying? You gotta have the right one. Yeah. Can't be getting the ones that champs. Yeah, you can't be getting the straight legs. <laughs> Basketball shorts. Who cut? You can't be getting sundresses to us. That's funny as a bitch. What good. it do, OX? They wearing apple bottoms. Who wearing apple bottoms? Dog no said niggas who wear true still ask for shorts and keep a wallet full of family pics. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man, Duh, me, you are nuts, bro. Yeah, niggas rocking Jordan Craig's like a Mary J's on my mama. No, you can't wear the 501s, bitch. No, homie. you can't wear the 501. Hell no. Grandpa, they brought Baby Fat back out. Them grandpas a motherfucker. Why not hell? And Baby Fat trash. Baby Fat back out? Yeah, Baby Fat back. They brought all that old shit back yeah. out, huh? Yeah. Rock and wear cover. <laughs> Sean John never went nowhere. Mm -hmm. He's still selling silk shirts at Macy's. With he, his name written all over the motherfuckers. Yeah, I mean, yeah he, who wearing that who shit? wearing? Because it's so many logos and, and prints on there. Like, what the fuck is this? No, I said, baby fat at City Trends. Levi's got a million different. They do. Levi's too versatile. Yeah. Baby fat at Walmart. On what? 
I was, ah, man, that's crazy. She must have got a bag for that. Y'all put me up on a lot of games in that. She got a bag for that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Maintain still. Her and Russell ain't busting no bumps. <laughs> Maintain still do the rock ports. Leo fool. Jordan Craig starting yo. Starting whack. to whack for them prices. Yeah, because uh, the, the, the shit too. that they make is trendy now. Pasty coming back to them. Dog, I don't want no fucking red monkeys. Them <laughs> big oh ass Oh, my jeans. God. Dog, there's some red monkeys, fam. Hey, you know what I saw, though, no. the other day? I don't know. A lot of you young niggas don't know nothing about this. But all the motherfucking boss <laughs> players know about this. Uh, Silver Star had cross colors. Yeah. They got cross color yeah. hats and shirts. Yeah, cross That's color it. Back. Damn. Cross color. Zoomy sell cross colors. For real? Yep. And uh, what's the other spot? Pac Sun and all them type of shit. Yeah. They sell Dog cross said colors. he still got Rock Force with the NBA socks. Feet stanking like a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> them NBA socks used to have niggas' feet stanking like no, a motherfucker. Okay. Rock Force with the NBA socks, though. Niggas used to think Dog it was fresh. Skills with that was shit. At levels with the Alley Hansons. <laughs> That it didn't even have a comeback for Leo ass. Duh, that's funny as a bitch. I'm waiting for guests to come back. I'm waiting for guests' pencil pocket pants to come back. All that other shit they can keep. Them gonna be fit. Them they could come back because they fit like skinny jeans. Jordan Craig used to be in K and G. Oh what? Yeah. Leo still wear his phone around his neck with a big ass jersey on backwards. So I will wear Carl Kanai. Who mad? Carl yeah, Kanai came Knight, back Carl out. Carl Kanai, Carl Kanai back, and it's taxing. That shit ain't I got cheap. some of their shirts on, yeah. I knew you knew about it, Maytay. You be up there, you be up there, you be out 10, you hear me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Pac Sun crazy. do sell gas. Sure do. Got the pants? Yeah, they say do. They just don't got the pencil pocket. They making right. regular pants like the style that's out right now. Right. Guess make them type of jeans, too. That Euro cut. You know For real? Saying? Yep. Ed Hardy on the way to <laughs> Ed Hardy. <laughs> Ooh, shit. Ed Hardy. Doug said on the Not way. Ed Hardy. What Ed Hardy back in the day was that shit. Oh, you though. had some Ed Hardy on. You was flashing on what? Hella dead skeletons and roses and shit on you. Love is pain. Hearts and fire and guns and roses and shit. Man, trends is a motherfucker, ain't they? Leo got to see through George from the gas station. <laughs> Maintain was that Jay's with a band-aid on his eye well, acting like, like that. Like <laughs> <laughs> Fubu sweat, sweaters with Fat Albert on it. Right. All these jerseys coming back out. I, I definitely went and caught me a couple jerseys. Yeah, you gotta get you, you gotta have you some jerseys in your They need to station. open Johnny Walker back up. Dawson said Von Ooh, Dutch making Johnny a comeback. Walker. They did try to Fubu push Von like a motherfucker. Spoiled, they did try to push Von Dutch back on us early. Von du- I got some Von Dutch. Yeah, they tried I got, to push what? That I got back Von Dutch popping right now. Bathing eight too, huh? Bathing eight, yeah. Bathing eight came back. Yeah, bathing eight back. Bathing eight back. Supreme and shit brought them back. They yeah, back. Jabot's got a new line. I doubt it. Maintain cop all his shoes from JL Marcus Wall. <laughs> Does it warn? <coughs> Christian Ardiger. Maintain. That's funny as a bitch. Christian Ardiger. That's crazy. I'm about to rock this fun Dutch again. Iceberg. Yeah, Iceberg came back a couple years ago. Leo got all his shoes from Kicks and Fits. That's funny. (laughs) (laughs) Not Kicks and Fits. Hey, remember Boosie got them fits from Kicks and Fits? He came and did a show with that whole fake-ass motherfucking, uh, uh, what was it? Was it? It Bay was Bathing Nate. Bathing Nate. Bathing Nate, Red Monkeys, yeah. all that shit. He had them. Literally $80 worth of clothes. They probably <laughs> charged him $700. <laughs> <laughs> he had them $80 oh, worth of clothes. Whole fit. All different colors and shit. What's that? They got nice shoes. Where? Boss Jeans. Boss Jeans? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> What Uncle Joe's do with all of Jamal? <laughs> <laughs> Burned them, I guess. Uncle Joe's got plenty of shit. Is with the straps Dusty coming is back? Huh? Jabos with the straps coming back? No. No? Them ain't coming back? No, them ain't coming back. Coney's back? Yeah, Sacconi back. Sacconi did shoe, come back. All the shoes All the old back. shoes. Yeah, ponies, uh, everything uh, is Deodors, back. Yeah. 
Puma uh, is back. All of them came back. I got yeah, Dior's back. Elise is back. Feli's came back, nigga. All that shit back, yeah. The Ewings is back. All Sean that shit. Sean John back. overalls from Viaggio's. Ah. <laughs> Nigga, you know what need to come back? Use. Use the damage. Tasha Hold on. Tasha dropped, that, dropped link, that link, y'all. Doc, somebody pin that. We can't pin no, that. We can't Let me pin see. It. Let me see what I can do with this motherfucker. Oh, yes, I can. Back up. Uh, pin that bitch. Mm. Uh, yeah, Tasha. Yeah, we dropped that link, y'all. She dropped that link, man. Go check out that. Uh, no, don't check it out right now. You got ten minutes, man. Go on and ten put minutes. Some... Click that link, <laughs> man. Go on and put them. Go on and put them Havana Joes. That's a cucumber fam. challenge. I got a pair of Havana Joes, man. Them Havana Joes call. They should bring Dada Jessica, back. My daughter want a pair of them big. Now they keep Dada, lines. bro. That boy I work with wear the Jimbo's <laughs> with the strap. The Jimbo's, ooh-wee. Ice cream's going to start popping up on these chicks' feet. That's fine. Me. They running out of shit to do. Biking shorts back. They said we about to lose Facts. viewers to go see her video. That's cool, man. It's all good. Oh, maintain. That's, uh, that's Tasha Ma Oh, oh, okay. She trolling. She trolling. She bogus. Oh man, they made she. Uh, she, 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 she fooled us. She faked us, man. The ibuprofen eight hundreds. Yeah, yeah. She Big sis fake, put me man. up on used and damaged back in the day. Eight hundreds ain't she coming was capping, back, bro. folks. That's for the ones that came up poor. That's funny as a bitch. XJ nine hundreds. I ain't never had no XJ900. No, I ain't never had none of them either. I told you. My mama took me to pay less one time, and I seen hustlers in that motherfucker. I said, ooh, I know what I want. Let me get some hustlers out this motherfucker. That's what Unk them was wearing. Yeah. Some You got to have your pair of hustlers in your, in your rotation. Yeah. Wallabies and shit. I said Daisy Dukes look good on these chicks. Remember, remember Eastlands back triple five soul back. Remember Eastlands. They should bring triple five soul back. Man, two of them was the funniest bitch. Eastlands was called. That's the story your brothers that used to work at. They yeah, used to sell plenty of that, that shit. Type of shit. Hell yeah, the twins worked at U.S. World downtown, Telling getting some red monkeys. Ugh, don't get no red monkeys, fam. I ain't get shit but church shoes and pay less. <laughs> British Knights nice is back, I yeah. think. Yeah, yeah you can it. order British Knights. Oh, no, you, know you can order them. Yeah, because Reebok is still making them, I guess. Yeah. 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 I said Nike Paco. Cortez look like hot dog buns on your feet. <laughs> <laughs> Doc wants to say said, something he, like she, a motherfucker. He pissed about that comment. What? <laughs> Nike Doc, Cortez. Doc loves yeah, the Cortez. Like the Easy E's. The, Doc, the dope don't say boy that. Nikes. Don't say that in front of Doc. Doc yeah, Vans are today's Eastlands. Yeah. Facts. She said Eastlands still out. They just Sperry's. That's funny as a bitch. Eastland with the Dockers and the Coogee. You was that nigga. Oh, my soul. Oh, my mama, you was that was nigga. Money. With one of them coach belts. Oh, you was having money. Oh. With, with the tag hanging off your coach belt. You was just Man, you ain't had no Eastlands. No Eastlands. <laughs> <laughs> with the Gucci. Yeah. See, the Eastlands yeah, with the Dockers and the Gucci, that was that shit. Eastlands. Oh, wait, you was flexing, flexing. Should not just kids crown. I love Vans, too. Ooh. I like Vans, too. The Cortez Nikes. And the Nuvi. <laughs> Definitely had the Nuvi. Don't had that the whole Nuvi. ensemble, bro. I'm a Milwaukee nigga. Yeah, for sure. Uh, uh, another challenge. What's everybody? What's up with everybody licking shit in the grocery store? Fucking disgusting. 
Niggas picking up ice cream, licking it, and putting the top back on the shit. And Ain't nobody buying no ice cream. And then we going in the store buying that shit. Motherfuckers, it's not ice cream sales gonna be low as a bit. Yeah, <laughs> ice cream sales gonna be at an all time low this year. That shit is crazy. Motherfucker gonna have to open up a popsicle and suck that motherfucker like shit. What the popsicles looking like? <laughs> they open. Dawg said the tag hanging off the coach belt. Snap. <laughs> yeah, they niggas gonna be going to get ice cream from cops. Starter coach came kids. back. Yeah. Hell yeah. On oh, my mama, the classic case Swiss. Back in the days. The tag mm-hmm. hanging off the coach belt. Yeah. Slapped Lyle, on my Lyle mama. got a pullover. Coogee with the biscuit, Tojo Bo. Uh, Tojo's. Bitches. I'm buying mama. sealed ice cream on my life. Flavors though, bro, like a bright color, like like teal green or or red. On what be killing they shit? Orange, <laughs> man, be fucking them up with the Joes. The Joes was serious. The Joe era was serious. Bouchard's was that shit back then. Damn, she said they doing that shit to salsa too. To salsa? Yeah. I don't eat a lot of I don't eat a lot of uh yeah. I don't eat a lot I don't eat Mexican food. Like what is people on with that? Like the clout shit is sick right now. Like this I, shit I did unpin that link. Yeah, fuck that link. I need some classic K Swiss right now. You ain't wrong. <laughs> I want to bring FUBU. Everybody said they want to bring FUBU back. I'm buying the white people ice cream. Got Diva. They ain't licking that. I ain't buying no ice cream until they get things situated. Man, what? <laughs> you going you gonna to open up that motherfucker? I'll be pulling up to the ice cream parlor and getting my shit. Like, Man, yeah. what? They going to have to put a lock on that motherfucker and call you what? over there like you get baby formula. Yeah. Hey, uh, <laughs> we need some uh, uh, help by the ice cream. I need a manager. For real. I he need 99 bottles of formula. Turn my stomach. Damn. <laughs> like, I damn, bitch, you had to tell the whole grocery Jones. store what I'm here getting? No, nah, they can keep your balls with the strap. You bullshit. You country as a motherfucker. Mm, I don't want them. <laughs> oh. I had to have a nigga with better jobs in the movie. Yeah, man. They still talking about that. Ain't they? I brought, brought up some memories. Niggas, yeah. think, niggas thinking about they whole fits and shit. Think. How they used to come, Ooh, the come Tommy, down. The Tommy with the gas. I used to kill with him at Marshall. I used to kill him at Marshall, fam. With the hair and bone? On what? Everybody had a him. hair and bone back in the days. I know I mama. had plenty of hair and bone. Fam, I went to homecoming. name on them and shit. Fam, African I went to the shit. Custer homecoming hair and bone. For Versace shirt like Puffy them nigga with remember, the Joes. Remember the African Killed medallions? Them, Everybody named Mama had an African medallion. Mm-hmm. The African. <laughs> yeah, that, that, with the, hey, with that, the gold. gold the Africans the made a bank around this shit. The what? Africans made a bank roll. Then the Chinese them came along and started bootlegging they shit immediately. On what? For real. That shit had started trending. Everybody was wearing used to that wear the shit. socks with the ball in the back. They still be looking for those, bro. They can't find them. They want those. Let's start a peach eating challenge. Ooh, Ooh. Keisha Terry. I, I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm for it, but I couldn't indulge because I'm a grown ass man. You know what I'm saying? All my peach I eating. I eat sliced be, peaches. Yeah, nah, all, how all about my, that? All my peach eating. All my peaches are sliced clothes. already. Yeah. <laughs> I will not be recording myself eating any peaches. exotic fruit. You feel me? Y'all got me fucked up. Right. We can have a watermelon eating contest. <laughs> watermelon. Now, my country, man, what you say? My Mississippi that Watermelon, ass. that meat. That, ain't that what they call it? You see, see all that good meat? Is that meat? You see how we <laughs> Like, boy, you left all that meat on there. Bring me that brine. Bring me that brine, Y'all little nigga. some gang shit. <laughs> That's how I used to come through with his Eastland song. Right. Hat bang like that. Oh, my mom. But on what the OG wouldn't be like, bring me that brine, little nigga. You left all that meat on that brine. Oh, we. Yeah, yeah. Hey, y'all remember when when the blue suckers came out? Motherfuckers like they causing cancer. Oh man, the blue suckers. Oh, blue suckers went crazy. Motherfuckers come to school with a whole box dumping, <laughs> selling you suckers for fifty cent a pop. Man, we trend. I break my our culture is so trend they got crazy. Niggas out bro. here doing the cucumber. They dog said they got niggas out here doing the cucumber. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Look, Jessica J, why not scales? Cause why you want to see me eat fruit on camera? 
I Ooh, break, I don't want to watch it. He said, I break my banana when I eat it. That's funny as a bitch. I definitely, we definitely don't want to see that. Right. She said she break her banana when she eat it. You can keep your video. See, that's busy with the doing. gold coin. I got a busy with the gold coin still. Yeah. That's still, that's still trending. I still got a busy with the gold coin, bro. I'm an old nigga, though. You I was motherfucker saying. spoiled. <laughs> my life. Straight up. They used to say that about the grape swishers. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Motherfuckers got oh, to eat the booty challenge. I'm gone, G. The Garcia <laughs> Vegas. Yeah, the Vegas. Remember the Vegas? Man, what? Worst thing I ever it's so much tar on that blunt, fam. On oh, the Garcia Vegas yeah, green leaf. Man, God yeah. damn, on that green leaf, it's so much I, tar. I know a nigga right now that smoke nothing but Garcia Vegas. Them little ass cigarillos, and he ain't put no weed in the motherfuckers. It's, it's, he addicted to the blunt. Y'all the, the said, remember Tequila Swisher. Never heard of it. Never had one of those. Remember, you remember the motherfucking mint, the uh, what was it, mint, uh, mint. uh Optimos, one peppermint, uh, Optimo, oh, whatever the yeah, fuck that that, was that shit was terrible. Vape, that motherfucker was vaporistic. Mentholy is a bitch. That was for them cigarette smoking ass niggas who smoke weed too. That's With mangoes and sour apple easy rolls was the word what? back what? in the day. Well, they still are though. With mango boy. That you get green that monster mango with the monster the for day. real. <laughs> she said yeah. that green monster was a monster. The green monster was a monster for real. Motherfucker. Black Titan Phillies. That's funny as a bitch. Man, we reminiscing like a motherfucker, man. With that being said, reminisce. <laughs> Take a picture. I don't give a fuck. Thank y'all for tuning in, though. This was Smoking Gossip. This is Smoking Gossip. This is episode 42. Yes, 42, sir. 42, Doug. Uh, we can't wait to have Bree back. She just had her baby. So once again, give it up for Bree for giving her baby. Uh, having her look cancer, you hear me though? Yeah. He was born on the 6th, right? Yep. What's the yeah. day? Like the 9th? 8th? Yeah. Yeah. Was he born on the 6th then? He was I, born on the 5th. Because he should be about three days old right now. Yeah, yeah. But shout out to Bree. Shout out shout to the out whole to family. Her shout daughter out to looked, Mike. Her daughter looked really happy. Congratulations. Congratulations on that. Uh, yep. With that being said, uh, I want to thank y'all for tuning in. Appreciate that, man. I can go by the name of Sport Rodney, the major nigga at the other end show. of the, uh, cool. appreciate it. The nigga at the other end of the table, we go by Harvey Scales Jr., but you yes, can sir. just call him Scales. And this is season two. And this is the, like, we in our glory month. You hear me, though? Like, this is like. When we first started doing yeah, this. Yeah, so this is, so we appreciate everybody that's fucking with us. No bullshit. Um, Scales, take us up out of here. Yeah, on the back of what he said, we done came a long way, and we still growing, and we trying to get better. There's going to be some changes coming soon to the format and what we doing. Like yeah. I said, if you want to sponsor, like Bigger G, better, baby. If you want to sponsor, like G's Clippers, Me Casa Su Casa, Trends and Benders, please hit up any of us or contact the Smoking Gossip page to do that. Also, subscribe to subscribe. our YouTube channel to catch up on any past episodes of Smoking Gossip. This was Smoking Gossip, episode 42. We out. Appreciate y'all.